Hi everyone, my name is Glenn Bartley and welcome to another YouTube video. I'm here today in Ecuador to do a little bit of a, a gear review on a new backpack that I've received recently from Lowepro. This is the Pro Runner 450 All Weather Backpack. And I uh, was interested in this bag because I travel a lot for photography. Most of my photography is done by flying somewhere and going to take pictures. And my old uh, travel backpack had recently packed it in after long and uh, great, great uh, 10 years using that bag. So I needed a new travel bag. And Lowepro was nice enough to send me this one to test out. And I have to say that after using it on this trip down here in Ecuador, I'm really enjoying this bag. Um, so let's get into some of the features of this bag here. The really nice thing, for those of you who travel for photography, is the size of the bag. So you, when you go up to the counter at the airlines, you really want a bag that looks fairly compact and not too big. And this bag really fits the bill. If you can believe it, I actually have my 600mm lens in here, a 300mm lens, camera body, flash, wide-angle lens, and quite a bit of other stuff. And if you look at it, it actually, especially compared to some of the carry-ons that a lot of people log onto these planes, it really doesn't look that big. Um, it's surprising how much you can fit in this little compact bag. Um, so it's, it's a pretty standard backpack, really. It comes with a lot of straps to latch things onto. I don't usually use those, um, so I actually snip them all off. Um, but overall, the bag has a main compartment in here. We'll look at that in a second. A nice front compartment where you can fit all kinds of little things. It's got a cell phone uh, area, an area for a clipboard or whatnot, pens, pencils, things like that. Handy little front pocket here. Got my wallet in there right now. And on the back here, hidden, is actually a laptop compartment. So you can fit up to a 17-inch MacBook Pro in there, or whatever your laptop is. Um, other than that, pretty standard handle on the top, handle on the side. Standard uh, Low Pro All Weather cover fits in here. It comes out when you need it, so that's great. Um, and yeah, if we look in the main compartment here, trying not to spill my equipment all over the place here, you can see I've got uh, things pretty tightly packed in there. 600 millimeter lens with the hood on. Body 17 to 40, flash 300 f/4. Definitely a tight squeeze, but. Um, Fits all you need probably for a traveling nature photographer. Lots of little pockets to fit memory cards and various bits and pieces. And uh, like I said, the main feature of this bag is that it doesn't look too big, really. Um, definitely haven't had a second look from one of the gate agents. Now, this is a review, so let's talk about a few things that I would love to see added to this bag. First of all, like right now I'm setting this bag down. You can see it's getting dirty and whatnot. I'm often in airports or out in the field in mud or in a boat, in a car, who knows. I would love to see this bag have this bottom section be some kind of little bit heavier weight vinyl or something that could be cleaned off if you needed to. Um, I'd love to see these straps be a little higher density foam. There's no need for them really to be this this poofy, although some people might, might disagree. Um, and perhaps the more important thing, although I can see why Lopro did it this way, is I would love it if the bag was actually an inch longer. I think they made it this size for official airline restrictions, but usually you can put it in sideways. If the bag was just an inch longer, I feel like you could fit it, the lens in there with a converter on, or maybe even the body mounted on the camera, which would free up quite a bit of space on the other side for an extra lens or a second body. So, all in all, I'm very happy with this bag. It's gonna be my new travel bag, and uh, I'm sure I'll get many years of service out of this one too. So thank you Lowepro for designing another good product. Thanks for watching this video. Be sure to like my page here and uh, share this video if you've enjoyed it. Thanks so much for watching.